of the big things I've been asking is, is why now? And I've spent a lot of time in emerging technology. There's always an inflection point. Why now? What's interesting about today and the metaverse and where we're at? And when I reflect on artificial intelligence, that's a space I spent a lot of time in, you know, the concepts are not new. That's been around for decades, but it's not very meaningful to say, I can run you a predictive model that's gonna tell you when you have a fraudulent transaction, give me four days, right? Not practically helpful. So when the hardware and the underlying technology got to a point where I could make that prediction in four seconds, all of a sudden it's meaningful. And I think we're at that similar inflection point with the metaverse. Right? The concepts have been around for a very long time. Second Life, any, anybody? Second Life, right? Um, that's been around for a long time. But what's happened is it's not as expensive or prohibitive to enter this space. And so as the technology has become commercially viable and commercially accessible, you're starting to see enterprise adoption and consumers are familiar with the metaverse and these augmented reality and virtual reality applications in their day-to-day -day life.